tequila lime chicken. It's like Jeffrey's favorite Friday night roast chicken, but with the volume turned up. What I'm doing is I'm gonna make a marinade for the boneless chicken breasts, and it's gonna make them taste so fabulous. So the first thing is a half a cup of tequila, always helps. And the next is freshly squeezed lime. It's really important. None of that bottled stuff. You really do need freshly squeezed lime juice. It makes all the difference in the world. So one cup of freshly squeezed lime juice. That actually also tenderizes the chicken. Half a cup of orange juice to give it a little sweetness. Chili powder to give it heat. One tablespoon. If you want more heat, you can use more chili powder. Mmm, that smells so good. <laughs> tablespoon of chopped garlic. Give it spice. And this is the key ingredient, jalapeno pepper. It's really hot. I'm gonna show you how this works. So you slice right in the middle. And what's really hot is the seeds. So I'm just gonna take the seeds out. And while you're working on this pepper, be sure that you don't touch anything you really care about before you wash your hands because it's incredibly hot. Don't rub your eye. <laughs> what I'm gonna do is just chop this finely. I like the tequila lime chicken to have a little bit of heat, but I don't wanna have third degree burns when we're done. <laughs> so, that goes right in. It's gonna be so good. Two teaspoons of salt. teaspoon of ground black pepper. And then the last thing is chicken. So I've got six boneless chicken breasts. I actually like them with the skin on. I think they stay moister. So I asked the butcher to take the bone off but leave the skin on. And I'm just gonna put them in the marinade. The great thing about this is not only is it good to leave it overnight, but it's actually the more it sits in the marinade, the better it tastes. So it's a wonderful thing to do for entertaining. So that's tequila lime chicken. It's gonna be so good on the grill.